What's happening, everybody? It's your old pal, Mr. Butter. And Mrs. Butter again. Coming right back at you. And we actually just finished up doing an in-hand look of the Bordeaux Jordan 1s. Mrs. Butter's never had a pair of Jordan 1 highs before or Jordan 1 lows or mids. No Jordan yeah. 1s. So I thought this looked like it had a good potential to be Mrs. Butter's first pair of Jordan 1s. It's one of my favorite silhouettes. And I knew she loved the color. I asked her if she would do an on-foot look if she wanted to keep them. And you do want to keep them? Yeah. All right. So here you have it. We're going to show you what they look like. And Mrs. Butter is going to be kind enough to model them for us. I asked Mr. Butter if we could show you why I really love this color. And that was our wedding, like we said in the last video, if you caught it. You can see Mr. and Mrs. Butter... 20 years ago when we first got married. Back when it all started. Yeah, right. crazy. Just a couple of kids. Makes me feel so old. Nah, <laughs> we're, we're, we're in our prime. You must really feel like family now because uh, she wanted to break out the wedding album here. But I don't know what. Which one that did you one. want? You show, you show. There we are. Almost 20 years ago. Babies. We're still babies. <laughs> Got me. Look, there's my favorite one. Look at that. Mine too. Yeah. I just wanted to show the color. That Our wedding party was all in that Bordeaux color as well. How do they feel on foot? They feel um, really comfortable, actually. Yeah. That leather is very, I mean, it really might be my favorite leather on a Jordan 1 this year. There's been a couple with really good materials. I feel like those yellow and black ones have really good materials. The pollen mm. that I wear to all the Steelers games. Yeah. And then also the patinas that I'm wearing right now, they have nice quality. But whenever they're soft, I, I think they're really comfortable, too. The bottoms can be flat. Some people like to put, you know, different insoles in them or whatever. But I think they're pretty good to rock as is. Yeah, they're really comfortable. I'm surprised I haven't had them beforehand now that I'm wearing them. Well, now we might have just unleashed a beast, you know, now that you have your first pair. Maybe you'll have... Right. Big monster. <laughs> yeah, right. Like a pro, Mrs. Butter. Go ahead and take a step or two closer to the camera. Nice. Now, what do you think? You wanted to keep the silver toes, and I didn't realize it until it was too late, and I already had them out the door. Do you think you'd rather have the silver toes than these, or? I wouldn't say rather. I think the silver toes would have been something that I could have worn more casual, but I think these can be both. They can be yeah. casual, but they can also be dressed. But I could also wear them with some leggings, I believe. And yeah. A, long sleeve t-shirt or, or something I jeans. think I think this pair will go with anything I think you know what the uh the silver toe shoes remind me of something that somebody would wear to like a Smashing Pumpkins concert or something you know what I mean they just look more like grunge rock t-shirt styles Very nice. You think you could dunk a basketball in them? For sure. Yeah, right. No question. Right. That's, yeah, that's what I like to hear. I'll tell you what, I think you could be a model, Mr. Fire. 
So, do you highly recommend the Bordeaux Jordan 1s? I do. Okay. All right, well, thank you You're for giving us an all folk look. Sure. I'm glad you like your shoes. Thank you. We need to go out on town sometime and. Someday. Someday, right. <laughs> someday. It's been a while, but. Um, all right, well, we appreciate you watching and we'll talk at you soon. Bye. We're out. <laughs>